In this tutorial, you will learn how to Photoshop a picture on iPhone, iPad, or any other iOS device. Photoshop is by far one of the best photo editing tools. Apart from using Photoshop on your computer, you can also work with it on any iOS device. We'll demonstrate you the app on iPhone. After you have taken a picture of yourself, normally you want to edit it before posting it to Facebook or any other social media. Free and default Photos app will help you to crop it and apply some effects. It can also assist you with removing red eye effect, however not very thoroughly. The Instagram app helps you to apply cool filters and add artistic touch, but what if you still have to reduce noise in the background in a more accurate way? Besides that, what if you want to reduce red eye effect? Only Photoshop can save your face. What to do? Just tap App Store App from your home screen and tap Search icon at the bottom of the screen. Type Photoshop on top of your screen in the search field. Once the app is located, tap Free button near its icon. When the button turns into Install, tap it again. Your Adobe Photoshop Express app is now downloading. Once download is finished, open. We are starting to install and customize our Photoshop app. Camera button allows you to take a picture of your surroundings or yourself. To reverse the camera on yourself, tap a little camera and arrow icon in the upper right corner. The plus minus slider is for zooming in and zooming out. To exit photo taking menu, tap the little cross in the lower right angle of your screen. Back in app's home menu, tap select photo. The menu with different albums of yours will appear. Tap the album you're interested in and tap the photo you want to edit. When Review menu opens, tap the little pencil icon at the bottom right part of the screen. Here's the editing menu, something we've been looking for. In the upper part of the screen you can see icons of different editing functions. Unlike full version of Photoshop, the app menu is reduced to the most popular Photoshop functions and operations that does not require big screen and much detail. Let's explore it from left to right. First comes Magic Wand that does the selection. Then it's Tools menu with a drop down that has Crop, Straighten, Rotate, and Flip. Next comes Adjustments icon with a drop down that has Exposure, Brightness, Contrast, Hue, Saturation, and Tint, Temperature. After Adjustments we have Filters, Black and White, Colorize, Sketch, Soft Focus, Sharpen, and reduce noise. The last icon on the right stands for further enhancements with a drop down that has collection of picture effects, borders, and more sophisticated red eye remover. Some of these options are not free. You have to pay extra to add them to your free package. First let's deal with filters icon and choose reduce noise. You'll see the minus to plus denoise slider. Slide with your finger to reduce the amount of the noise to the optimum. Looks okay now? Let's save it. From the same drop down on the right, we tap Effects. We can see that we have free picture effects on the top of the screen. Let's apply Rainbow. We tap the tick icon again to save the effect. Looks cool. Now, when our picture is ready for Facebook fame, let's explore the sharing options of the app. Tap the little picture and arrow icon at the bottom of the screen to launch Sharing Interface. You can choose now from several options to share. Email, Facebook, Twitter, and Tumblr. We'll tap Facebook. Adobe Photoshop Express wants to publicly post on our behalf? OK. We see our picture once again. Make sure we still want to post it and tap Share. We're on Facebook. It's great to be famous. Congratulations, you have just learned how to Photoshop a picture on iPhone, iPad, or any other iOS device. This was a How Tech tutorial. Like us on Facebook, love us forever, or leave us a comment here in the fields below. Thanks for watching.